Adobe Animate Tutorials Adobe has their very own animation software called Adobe Animate. This software can be used in a wide variety of animation projects of all kinds and can be a great addition to your Adobe suite of software. In our video today, we will list our pick of the best tutorials made for Adobe Animate that explore the software's full potential. So without further ado, here are our favorite Adobe Animate tutorials. How to get the best line work in Adobe Animate 2022 by Tip Dutt. If creating fluid and crisp looking line work for your sketches is an essential step in your art process and the essence of your art, you might want to check this tutorial by TipTot. In this video, TipTot shows us how we can get the best out of Animate's frustrating brushes. The video explores three main categories of tips. The first one relates to the configuration of the software's different brush settings. The second is all about making changes to your workflow and Animate. And lastly, TipDot gives you, yes, you specifically the animator, tips on how fixing your posture for instance can have a tremendous impact on the way your line work looks, coupled with other really helpful and well explained tips. As usual, TipDot's tutorial is nothing short of excellent. With on-point narration with perfectly mixed audio, a sectioned video with timestamps, and a great mix of footage that shows everything in detail. We highly recommend this video to all line art nerds out there. Time-saving tips for Adobe Animate CC by Devin Kong in this sweet and short video of 4 minutes and a half, Devin gives us some valuable time-saving tips on Adobe Animate. He starts off by a time and possibly life-saving tip, which is how we can copy and paste something in the same place instead of randomly on the page. This can be such a great way of efficiently drawing similar frames that have very slight movement. The next tip Devin goes into is how we can edit multiple frames at the same time, which can be a valuable tool in big scale animations. And lastly, he explains how we can use the find and replace feature in Adobe to quickly change a given color on all of our frames. What an amazing tip! If any of this has gotten you excited at all, we highly recommend you watch Devin's video. The video is narrated in its entirety, it is short and straight to the point, and has the great old timestamps to skip ahead or go back to a specific part. Motion Guide Path with the Pen Tool, an Adobe Animate CC tutorial by This Guy Does Animation. This Guy Does Animation couldn't have made the purpose of his video tutorial more obvious with that title, even if he tried. If you still have trouble understanding the purpose of the tutorial, it shows you how you can use the Pen Tool in Adobe Animate CC to control the path your animation takes. He uses the example of a car going through a particularly squiggly road, which serves as a single and easy to understand template. The tutorial is divided into five parts, with stamps and goes through each step thoroughly. The last part is especially cute. Dad! Dad! Guess what? What? Super five! Oh my goodness! How did that happen? So if making your animation run along a certain path is something you want to learn, check this guy does animations tutorial. How I animate frame by frame, animate and after effects workflow by plainly simple. In this video tutorial, Marvin shows us how he goes about doing frame by frame animation by using a mix of Creative Cloud software, Adobe Animate, After Effects, and Photoshop. He starts off by explaining that the style of animation will determine which software he uses. If the animation has a vector feel to it, with solid colors and a strong line art, he would use Animate and After Effects. If the animation has a traditional feel to it, Photoshop is added to the mix. Once that's out of the way, Marvin jumps into the workflow in immediately. He takes care of explaining all his steps, sprinkling tips here and there from research to After Effects. Get it? Because he applies effects in After Effects and it's like the last step. No? Okay, I'm, I'm seeing myself out, alright? All in all, this is a great video to watch to familiarize yourself with the software and other people's approach to things. No matter if you are a professional or a beginner, who knows? You might learn something or two.
Use symbols like a pro with color effects and Adobe Animate CC tutorial by Devin Kong. Devin is coming back to us with yet another time-saving video that shows us how we can use animate symbols. A heads up before you watch this video is that it assumes you have some basic knowledge of symbols. If not, fear not. Devin has a video tutorial explaining those basics for you. The tutorial goes into how we can use different options to make changes in symbols. Changes that can make our animation process faster and our colors much better. Devin goes into brightness, tint, alpha and tweening, the advanced color effect, and that is how the video is sectioned and timestamped. As usual, the video is narrated entirely, and Devin's explanations are simple, straight to the point, and easily understood. So we highly recommend this video and his channel as a whole for anyone wanting to learn more about Adobe Animate. Create 2D FX Quick Start and Intro to Adobe Animate by VFX Apprentice. In this tutorial, Jason Kaiser shows us how we can animate a cool special effect animation in Adobe Animate. The first part of the channel's intro to Adobe Animate serves as a way to show you how to animate as well as familiarize yourself with the software. If you are the kind of person who learns by doing, this might very well be the tutorial for you. This tutorial has a second part but isn't related to this first part in a way that it continues the animation process of the VFX. Instead, it goes into teaching you how to navigate the software software, the tools and the features, and so on and so forth. It is more theory than practice in comparison to the previous one. If this looks like and matches your preferred way of learning, we highly recommend you check both videos out. Proper Character Rigging in Adobe Animate by Tip Tut We are back to you with another excellent video from the Adobe Animate master himself, Tip Tut. This time around, Tip Tut shows us how we can rig a character to animate. The video tutorial is in two parts. The first part shows us how we can prepare our character for rigging, from setting up the circles, populating the symbols, to working with registration points. As usual, both parts are well made and thoughtfully explained with a lot of information. The video tutorial is well narrated with great audio and sectioned with timestamps. Make sure to check this out if rigging characters is something you want to learn in Animate. Animate Fire Learn Adobe Animate by Production Crate Production Crate shows us in this video how they make fire animation. No, really, animation of fire. Put their fire, so that checks out. The video is made with a really fun approach that makes learning really enjoyable. It is also beginner friendly as Production Crate are themselves more comfortable using After Effects and don't have much experience using Animate. Do not let that fool you though. The tutorial is densely populated with everything you need to know about animating cool fire animations. The tutorial is packed with all the educational goodness while also being properly paced and not leaving a moment of boredom. If all of my college lectures were made this way, I'd be a genius. Genius, but oh well. We highly recommend this video if you want to make a fire animation effect. Even if not, this can serve as a real fun introduction to animate. Modern Rigging Flexi Bone by Adobe Animate. This one is presented by the owner of the house themselves, Adobe Animate. This video tutorial shows you all you need to know about the Flexibone tool in Adobe Animate. Since this is made by Adobe themselves, you can expect professional and quality content. So you can watch this video knowing you will learn something. The video is not that long, it is about 5 minutes. It's entirely narrated with great audio quality and correct subtitles. Unfortunately, the tutorial does not have any timestamps, but it is short and straightforward enough to not warrant them. So yeah, check this video out for a quick lesson on rigging. Adobe Animate CC 2019 Tutorial Slash Time Lapse Animating Endeavor BNHA the last tutorial on our list is a bit different than the previous one. This time around, it is a time lapse of a frame by frame animation made in Adobe Animate. With written explanations throughout this two part tutorial, your learning preference can really make or break this tutorial for you. If you are more into seeing how people do things instead of a narrated tutorial, this can be a great tutorial for you. If not, you might not appreciate this tutorial. We recommend you check it out and see if you like it or not. One thing's for sure is that every step is well explained. And that was that for our video. Let us know if you liked any tutorial in particular. With that being said, see you around.